what is up you guys i am back with another video of course i'm just gonna basically gonna be starting off with my day i am currently literally on my break for work i'm low-key panicking tomorrow i have my birthday photo shoot and i'm scheduled to work tomorrow and the shoot is literally gonna be around 7 and i work 3 30 to 7 30. i'm literally trying to figure out a way to try to switch my schedule without calling out because they've been on my ass girl they have been on my ass and i've been calling out like crazy i'm not trying to get fired yet I have this last resort. I'm trying to switch with my coworker to see if we could do like a split shift or something. Hopefully it works out. Worst case scenario, unfortunately, I'm gonna have to fucking call out. I'm just stuck. I'm just panicking, whatever. What's gonna consist of today is basically I'm actually gonna get my brows laminated, guys. Look at my brows right now. So they finally officially grew out. If you guys remember like how my brows used to look like right here, they were little cute little little fucking arrows or some shit little fucking signals or some shit like that i don't know <laughs> i'm gonna be getting my brows laminated by these brows underscore lashes i'm gonna include her little username right here but she's gonna be doing me the favor and doing my brow lamination so for tomorrow for my birthday photo shoot i am so excited it is a bit of a drive my appointment's at 4 30 i'm off at 2 30 so i should definitely make it in time and i did actually wash my hair today too so it's in braids it's a little frizzy but i did add some moroccan oil to make sure it's a little hydrated and stuff hopefully you guys really enjoyed this i'm just really excited it doesn't feel like my birthday week weekend or like anything of that sort so i'm kind of like ah, i don't know i'm gonna be turning 24 guys like i already feel like i'm already 24 i'll go right ahead and see you guys right when i'm off of work and basically when i'm headed over there i just officially already got off work i'm already changed i'm already out of my uniform and all that stuff and i came home of course to change and now i am on my way to go get my brows laminated now i literally have to go put in gas real quick of course i'm always running low on fucking gas i usually go to the one by alantas because it's a lot cheaper but I'm right here by my area. So in that case, I gotta spend a little bit more on that. I'm gonna put at least like 20 bucks or something just to go right ahead and hurry on over there because I'm literally barely gonna make it, if anything. <laughs> the drive is 45 minutes and that's with the traffic already picking up. So hopefully it doesn't pick up anymore and I don't get there more later than I am expected to be there. Join me with pumping gas. So I am here guys, I'm gonna pump it in some gas. Got myself some $20, so I should be good. I am on pump number one. So let's get a get and get that. Hi, how are you? Are you? I'm good, can I put 20 on one please? Okay. There you go, thank you, have a good one. Well, that was easy. She was so nice. But this specific person that actually um, works here, her name is Crystal. She is so nice. She's always been really nice to me. She's really chill. And she actually told me to follow her page. She actually sells like ashtrays and like all that stuff. So I'll leave the little link right here. I want more gas gallons. All right, guys, not gonna lie. I had to let her know that I am gonna be running about like five minutes late. I want to go put in gas and stuff. And then it's like, go dumbass, like, come on, bro. And then I realized I didn't have my Nick pen. So, <laughs> so I want to go get that real quick. I swear, y'all, I was doing so good with not fucking hitting my neck or even buying one for like, probably I would say a week. And then I was good. I wasn't feeding it or like I wasn't like wanting it or anything until my friend, she decided to bring some because she works in the little um, warehouse of that stuff, like with the vapes. And she was like, oh, look, here, I brought you guys some. And I was like, I was trying to quit. And she was like, oh, my gosh, I'm so sorry. But I'm like, no, it's okay. Like, I honestly don't mind it. Regardless, I was planning on getting one for my birthday because I'm going to be like drinking and I like to like smoke while I'm drinking and stuff. So don't trip girl you're good hopefully traffic doesn't pick up a, uh, more or anything because it is traffic hour i will see you guys there when i pull up <laughs>
so I officially got off the freeway traffic actually wasn't too bad at all it was like pretty slow and like it wouldn't move at one point but I'm only five six minutes late so um I'm just about to get there and I'm so excited bitch these brows mmm they're about to get laminated, bitch. I officially made it. And I just let her know that I am here. So I'm just going to wait for her to respond. But I am so fucking excited, guys. Like, you don't even know, like, how bomb my brows are going to be fucking looking. Even though they look thin, I'm pretty sure they're going to look bomb. Okay, you guys. So I just got here with these brows underscore lashes. What was your name, by the way? Sorry. Stacy. Stacy. So Miss Stacy, she is here. Sorry, Daisy. Oh, Daisy. Sorry. I'm here like, Stacy. <laughs> but this is Daisy. She's here gonna do my brow lamination. You guys, her studio was so adorable. Look at she already has like is literally already up ahead with the literal like Halloween decor. It's like look at how cute this is. Hi me. Ah. <laughs> but if you guys want to go right ahead and you know hit her up, you guys are gonna see the results right now on how my brows are gonna look. But this is her Instagram. Go right ahead and follow her. Shoot her a DM, of course. Tell us about you. What's up? Um. So I do. Uh, brow lamination, yeah, extensions, and I've been doing it for about two, three years already. My brows and honestly they look amazing bitch i'm not gonna try to move too much because she's taking little cute before and after pictures but y'all they look so good <gasps> bitch so for the first 24 to 48 hours you can't wet them or get into hot water steam um it will literally ruin your brow lamination mm -hmm. um you also want to avoid water mm -hmm. um and after that, you pretty much do anything and you put aloe vera gel to brush them up again. Ooh, so after the 40 hours, I'm able to like wash my face like normally. You can even put makeup on them, yeah. Oh, shit. Gosh, guys. So literally like, that's literally the procedure of how you do it, guys. So honestly, like, I love them so fucking much. This is the full view, me standing up and stuff, but dude, they look so bomb. Of course, I just need to pluck my brow so that was nice out, or else, you know, they would look a lot bomber. But of course, thank you to Daisy. She literally, ugh, she made them look amazing. But once again, guys, go right ahead and visit their page. Of course, it's called These Brows underscore Lashes. Hit them up if you guys wanna get your lamination or your lashes done or anything, guys, because honestly, She's the sweetest. They are amazing. <laughs> Bitch. Who this? Who this? Hold up. Stop the camera. Stop the camera. It's me, bitch. It's Irma. Dude, I'm so obsessed with my fucking brows. They are so genuine and easygoing people. Like, I love them so much. Like, I generally, I'm so obsessed with my brows. And I just can't wait for my shoot. Like, <laughs> Okay, you guys. So, I kind of had to make, like, a quick, like, pit stop, I guess you could say. I came to Ulta only because I have the curling iron that Ilan ended up getting me for the shoot. But the thing is that I struggle with this curling iron because it's the clamp one. And I don't know how to use the clamp one. I literally even looked up a YouTube video on how to do it. But I think the hair is just too long and, like thick that i couldn't do it i'm gonna be going into ulta to go ahead and return this um curler only because it just didn't work out so i'm gonna do a land a favor and let's see if they give me actual the money back or if it might be store credit who knows Oh, yeah, sorry. Well, were you were, I think you were in line first. No, go for it. I have a return that's gonna take a minute, so you're good. Hi, so I have a return for the um, curling iron. Um, I didn't know how to use it. <laughs> Literally, I was like, I'm lost, so I wanted to do that, but it was under my friend's account that they did it for. Yeah, okay, cool. <laughs> my bad. And that would be like store credit or would that be like cashback or how would that work? 
So for her, I have to see how she paid for it and it'll let me know. So if that's gonna go back to her Ameri American structure. Perfect. I just need a signature. Yeah, that's totally fine. You want my autograph, I understand. Oh, <laughs> perfect. Thank you, you too. Have a good one. That was easy. So that was a success, at least, for returning the curler. Now, Loki, I have the shits. And I need to hurry up home to fucking take a shit. Si no, me voy a cagar. That was a success. I don't know where it ended from the other clip because my phone died. But I have to take a fucking shit. I'm going to hurry up home because it's probably like a 30-minute drive still. Later on today, I'm actually going to put on my press-ons just so I could be ready for tomorrow. And I don't have to feel rushed because I still have work tomorrow morning. Unfortunately, I guess. But yeah, but the good thing, at least my work worked out like my schedule and stuff but yeah i actually ended up going home i did my business as i told y'all i needed to low-key take a shit and it was amazing and then of course i actually ended up eating real something real quick because i actually didn't eat anything all day and now i am here at alan and danny's house ready to chill and ready to relax i guess you could say and then also i actually wanted to record basically like showing you guys me putting on the press-ons miss psycho makeup ended up sending me these nails if you guys didn't see my instagram story i don't know what you're doing but she ended up sending me these nails and they are so cute so i'm basically just gonna be like doing a little montage of me placing them on and stuff um, i'm not really gonna be talking much but yeah i just wanted to show you guys how i basically do the process to make sure that these last on me let's do this Okay guys, so I finished putting on the nails. I try to put them as straight as possible. I think my fingers are just chuecas. They're so beautiful. I feel like a bad bitch. I feel like a new bitch. And then I also tweezed a little bit under my brows because they did look a little too like, you know? With plucking them, I think they look a lot better now and more cleaner. I just feel good. <laughs> I feel like I'm ready for my birthday. I feel like this is probably the bestest I've ever felt in a good while. I love it.